Hi, hopefuls. Thanks so much for coming back to my channel today. Welcome. If you're new, my name is Hope and I love to do grocery hauls and um, I do all different types of things on my channel. I just got back into couponing, so I've been doing that and um, originally doing like uh, DIYs, home decor, little small parties and events for my family. And if other people ask me to do um, something for them so just all those different things so welcome so um yeah welcome so today i went to walmart and i didn't mean to get this much but we needed it um but i also went mainly <laughs> for prepping items so i have been prepping i have been on this journey i didn't even know what a prepper was and i saw a great video by simply sherry and i had just went down the rabbit hole ever since um i love to be prepared for my family because it has been years that we have went without thank goodness i found out about couponing when it was a whole lot of great coupons the coupon for food <laughs> um but uh yeah so i love to be prepared and so i don't know what the future holds but even regardless of you know i just want to be prepared okay y'all so when what i'll do in this haul is i'll point out if i picked it up for prepping and prepping is like um just having like some 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 food or items on hand in case you're not able to get to the store or um, just having a stockpile, y'all. That's what prepping is. Okay, y'all. So let's start over here. I was long overdue for the vitamin C. Um, I think I picked up the last two of these of the Nature Made. I think we had a different one before, but um, they were quite pricey. But I picked up two of these, and we're taking these now. So they probably won't. I don't know. We'll try to get some in our stockpile, but it'll be hard. I also got some flushable wipes. I have some wipes already in our stockpile um, upstairs. And what I'm also going to do probably this week, y'all, is show you what my progress or updated stockpile or prepping prepper, preps look like. So if you want to see that, and then I guess um, in another couple of weeks, I'll show again. Okay. Um, I got some flushable wipes. So Josiah loves to use those. I pulled my nail back out the other day, and it was just bleeding, bleeding, bleeding. It's kind of hurting, so I need to be careful. I need to put another Band-Aid on it. I got some wipes. I forget about baby wipes now, but they are your lifeline when you have little ones. Um, the size getting big, but I need you need wipes um, for anything, you know, to clean something off. So I want this in our stockpile. These were like $1.97, so, no, $1.78. So I'll just get some gradually as time goes on. The coupons are not that great for the wipes. It's like 50 cent off of two and it just expired yesterday. So this is for prepping. Um, those flushable wipes are for prepping, but we do use um, the stockpile upstairs because I have some more wipes. Okay, so I got some potato wedges. I got a lot of food so the boys can find, fend for themselves because um, some, a lot of days I don't feel like cooking. So fend for themselves. Um, yeah, I was about to say something. Sometimes y'all, I'm about to say something in my video and I'm like, no, nah, let me not say that unless I know I'm gonna do it. So yeah, okay. Then I'm gonna share with you guys. So the wedges, I got this one. I got the steak fries. The wedges are seasoned, some tater tots and I got some crinkly cut fries i got some corn on the cob i love this purdue chicken i turned my mom on to the simply smart Org organic chicken breast gluten free i love this now so when i hurt my fingernail um i thought i had some peroxide um Cottrell is obsessed with peroxide he was brushing his teeth with it but i told him you have to dilute it because he was um probably the lining of his mouth was getting raw or whatever and um i was using his the other day i had to get it out of their bathroom and i realized we didn't have any peroxide i don't think i thought we did so i said let me pick this up they were 88 cents and this is for our preps so that um we can have this on hand as well i got some more band-aids i usually get some from the dollar tree i know there has been some coupons at dollar general so i will try to 
use those uh, coupons next Saturday. So I picked these up, they were like $4. I needed some more antibacterial soap. We have a lot of soap, but we have like Olay, Dove, um, Dove Men's. And I did buy a three pack of this off of Amazon in the gold antibacteria, but I just wanted to have more for preps. And so I will um, pick up maybe another one. This is something we go through really quickly, bars of soap. So um, I have to probably pick that up every once in a while to have that stocked up, but we have a lot of other soap. Okay, so the Tylenol cold and cough sore throat. I went ahead and picked this up because I realized that we have ibuprofen, Aleve, Tylenol for all the big people, but nothing for Saya. So I also picked up the pain and fever um, ages two to 11. And this is a strawberry. And I think it was like four or five or $6. For these, the expiration date is February, 2022. So that's pretty good. I needed some more butter. And I was watching a video. No, I wanted to watch a video. It's on my list to watch where she canned some butter. I don't know if it's fresh butter or not, but I don't know. I'm really thinking about canning. I ordered three books, but it's really hard to find the pressure canning pressure cooker. Um, so I don't know, y'all. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that or not. I might can do it another way. I don't know if I can use my Instapot Kasori. I don't know if I can use, I think I use a regular pot too. But I'm not sure, y'all. So, anyway, my three books are coming. So, I got some butter, and I said, I know I can put the butter in the freezer and, you know, just get a little bit at a time. Okay, I got some cream cheese, um, the chives and onion, but I forgot to get the bagels. I got some tomatoes and some pineapple. I'm loving fresh pineapple right now. I got some more corn muffin mix because I always say I'm going to get it later. And I was like, hope get it now. I did just get some in an Aldi haul, and I didn't put that stuff up. By the time you guys see this, um, yeah, you'll see that Aldi haul. I just did it yesterday from Instacart, and it mainly that stuff was for prepping, so that's why I had to go to the grocery store again. Um, French toast cinnamon sticks. I don't get this a whole... I, I do get it, but I haven't got it lately because... You know, usually the bag is like way down here, and then my key is to eat a lot of it, and then it goes. But that's why I got two of them. It is the cinnamon sticks, and they were like 208. I got the strawberry cheesecake muffin mix and the blueberry muffin mix cheesecake. They do have regular blueberry, but the cheesecake is better. I used to get this all the time with couponing. They were like um, on sale for like, I don't remember y'all. Yeah, I don't remember, <laughs> but they had coupons all the time for these. So I had a big stockpile of these and they, I just don't see any coupons anymore for those. But these, I got this for prepping mainly because you can just add milk with this. So a lot of times when we didn't have milk or something, I used, um, not sweet and condensed, but I used evaporated milk, then used dry milk. So if you want something sweet and cute, then you can't get to the store. Okay, y'all, so I got some broccoli stir fry, and I usually make two at a time. So I put it in a big, a big muffin pan, or I put it in the 12 muffin pan, and I usually don't just make one. So, um, meaning I made two strawberry cakes, but they were high on the back of the shelf, and I couldn't reach it. So I just pick up some more later. So if I make two packages at a time. My mama, um picked this up she said she likes to use this it was 233 the broccoli stir fry and she said she put shrimp and chicken and stuff like that so i thought i'll try that she must have her own sauce like all these sales well walmart and all those stores do too but like on her own orange teriyaki you know sauce like that but i guess you can be super healthy and don't even use none of that hot today uh, it's hot okay so i got three of the broccoli florets trying to cool off i got two of the sweet peas i have been watching yesterday i was just sitting here watching prepping videos if you're not careful watching prepping videos they will have you paranoid and i don't want nobody to watch my videos and be paranoid at all but what he mentioned was some certain things were starting to get scarce in the store and um so i googled the company that he was showing not company but yeah the company that published the article and um some of the things that they were saying 
um, I think other things that they said were not necessarily true or they were banned from Facebook from saying certain things. But sometimes you can take bits and pieces from what somebody says, even though it could be true or false, you know, and make your own your own opinion about it or your own thoughts. So I was paying attention to what was in the store, watching what other people, not everything, people was buying. And I'm going to show you some canned goods I got because Walmart doesn't have a limit on their canned goods, not at my store. But they didn't have any sweet peas, I noticed. So they only had frozen sweet peas, my whole point of saying all that, y'all. Frozen sweet peas. But I only really, I will eat these. But um, I didn't get a whole lot of the frozen because i rather have the can. <laughs> a whole lot of the can, if that makes sense. Because they just taste better. That's the only reason why, y'all. Even though this is better for you. Okay, I got two chopped spinaches. I was noticing, too, like a lot of the bacon stuff is still thin. They still didn't have any yeast, so I'm going to have to. I got some yeast the other day from Aldi, but I'm going to go get some more from Aldi. So I was just paying attention to different things on the shelf. Um, I got some Bunker Hill chili. I probably should have got two. Um, the super thick bologna. I just wanted some bologna. Um, I got two of the um, chocolate icing. This is for preps. Um, someone suggested hope you can have kids, so make sure you have something sweet for them. And um, yeah, so that's what I wanted to do. I also had an Instacart order and they they didn't have any cake mix. All they had was the brownies. So I picked up three of the yellow cake mix for preps, and this is a dollar. Of course, I have stuff, I bought stuff to make my own cake, but y'all know, if you want something quick, yeah. So I got the big thing of chicken nuggets. I also got some more Progresso soup. I just get a little bit at a time, and I got this for prepping. Um, some chicken rice. Um, they were kind of picked over, but they've been picked over. Um, the tomato basil soup and the chicken noodles. So tomorrow, I think the trail may work tomorrow. When I drop them off, I may run into that Walmart. It's a different Walmart and see what they have. I also got this beef Philly cheesesteak. I think they have it in chicken too, but I used to get this. It used to be in a box years ago. I think I said this before. Years ago when J Cottrell was a baby um, and I was still in cosmetology school. So, yeah. So, I got two of these. They're kind of expensive. You get four cheese steaks in each one. I got two bags. They're $11.96 each. I got some ground turkey, some pepperoni. Um, today, I am making, I forgot the garlic bread, some lasagna and meat sauce because I was like, what can I? I don't pick this up a lot. What can I make super, super quick? for them today. And so I'm gonna be tired when I get home and I got other stuff to do. And I gotta move this furniture out the living room. Well, I'm not moving the furniture, but move all the little stuff um, because um, they're gonna put some more carpet down. Okay, y'all, and yeah. Some thick cut bacon. This was high, it was like $7.12. And the bacon is really, all of that breakfast stuff I noticed is really picked over and I think because all the kids are at home and breakfast has to be served. Or, yeah. I got the 16 count um, ballpark franks. And then I got, for prepping, some chunk chicken breast. I don't really care for this, but if I didn't have a choice and I needed some chicken, I think this will be pretty good. So, it was only like $3.22. Is my nail broke? Yeah. Then I got some by the complete seasoning. I was really hoping they had the big thing today, but they didn't. Bigger than this. And yeah, so maybe I took the other Walmart. I got some cheese, some premium sausage, um, some turkey smoked sausage. I think I got two of these. The other one's over there. I got some potatoes. I almost thought it was falling. Some bacon potatoes over here. We love baking potatoes. We make a baked potato, throw it in the oven. I like it in the oven more so than the microwave because, um, I don't know. Every time in the microwave, I always have to guess, even with the potato button. So I just put it in the oven for a little while. But anyway, I got the eggy egg slicer. And I got this because mama got one. It was like 2000 some change, Lord have mercy. So, um, I was like, what you going to do with that? Because she always asked me, what, what am I going to do with that? Or how am I going to decorate it? And I'll be like, I don't know, mama. 
Okay, hold on y'all. Got 12 of the green beans. These were only 38 cents. So I got 12 of these. These are the pop tops. Um, they wanted some snacks. Got these, some fans, and some cheddar sour cream. Then I got one of these lemonades. I had a coupon to correspond with it, but forgot to use it. But it's okay. They were a dollar. Then I got the Minute Maid pink lemonade. Here, see, I got all my Aldi stuff still sitting here. I had to make sure everything dried, and then I have the right dates on them, so it's still sitting there from the up uh, from yesterday. 2% milk, some orange juice, some lemonade, the other smoked turkey sausage, some Italian hot sausage. I usually, um, with this, I cut it out the casing and I chop it up and I put, I still didn't edit that video because it's in my old camera, that's why. Um, with turkey, ground turkey, and I make my spaghetti. So I can, I love turkey, ground turkey as spaghetti. Um, in our in my spaghetti, but I also like to add this. I seen my mother in law do it years ago, so I don't use it a whole lot with ground beef with spaghetti. But yeah, here is the other Philly cheese kit. Um, I got two of the jug water for our prepping and distilled water. I need distilled water. This is gonna be something that's gonna be hard for me to stock up on because I don't. I need to take. I said last night I was gonna take note of how often. I go through these, but I do need to pick this up and stock up on it because I need this for my CPAP machine. And um, so every time I go on Walmart, I need to pick up several, 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 several. I don't know how it's gonna be impossible to stock up on that. And where in the world I'm gonna put it. Okay, y'all, so some 16 corn dogs. Um, I got this, haven't got this in a long time. And JJ and Josiah was like, I love corn dogs. And then some ground, black pepper i need to stock up on this i have like the grated kind but i needed some more of this i got the roll which i often get y'all see me get the 80 20 ground beef and this is like 12 11 dollars hi y'all i got the value bag of cooked shrimp medium and i had to look at my receipt to see how much this was i got this as well um, I think I'm about, I have about this much left, but I got some more of these. These are like nine, ten dollars and I probably should not be using the gummies, but that's a whole nother story. That's just me. Anybody else can. Um, the Alive Men's, haven't tried this before, but got this for Jason. It's eight dollars and the Tennessee Pride Sausage Biscuits. Hopefully they will not go through these like water. I'm trying to think if that's everything, y'all. Y'all, that is everything. So we're gonna put everything up. I already have the oven preheating. I hate, I forgot the garlic bread for this today. I really beat that box up in the store. So guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the very next video. Bye-bye.